Hey you guys, what's up? It's Kristen. And today I am going to be doing my two-week review on my modern show hair. So you guys stay tuned. I'm so ready to do this review for y'all. It's been a minute since I talked about this hair, so Okay, let's you guys, do so it. as we all know, um, this will be my two-week review. I had did an initial review, like opening the package review on this hair. I'll post that link below. <clears throat> and I also did a video of me actually coloring this hair. Um, showing you guys the results of the coloring for this hair. So that link will be below too if you would like to know the products I used and da 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 da. Alright, All right, so just some little plugs real quick. This is Ruby Woo by, of course, Matt Cosmetics. Um, I want you guys to take a look at my friend's blog. His name is Chris Quarterman. The blog is called Lajano Chris. <clears throat> so I'm going to post that link below too. He gives you the tea on everything. That's like one of my best friends. I love him. So make sure y'all check that out. Please, 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 please. Another thing. I want you guys to go look on my god sister's website, um, boutique um, website. It's on bigcartel.com. And I will post that link below as well, okay? So make sure you do that. And let's get to talking about this hair because I got some stuff to tell y'all. It's looking good right now. But I'm going to give you the tea, the insider, the 411. Okay, guys. Here as you go. can see... <clears throat> my hair is laid. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, honey, it is, it is. I got that lace closure. And um, first off, I want to shout out to my hairstylist, Omega Berry. I call her Mega. She always lays my hair down. I love her. She keeps me popping. The only person I go to to really do my hair, like, you know, because she keeps it looking perfect. But, um, so, yeah, it's looking, I really like it. Anyways... To this hair. Like I said, this show is called Modern Show Hair off of AliExpress. Now, a lot of y'all gonna be real skeptical about Ali skeptical about AliExpress. But let me tell you, there are a few good vendors on AliExpress. So don't just blow it off automatically like, oh, that's AliExpress hair. Da -da 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 -da. No, don't blow it off like that. Just listen. Just listen. Get the 411. Okay. First, okay. Shipping for this hair. Three days, exactly, from the time I ordered it, three freaking days. And you will see all of that. You will know all that information if you just go watch my initial review. So if y'all go watch the other reviews, all your questions that you might have will be answered in those other videos because I'm not going to review all of that. I don't want this video to be too, too, too long. So, yes. All right, you guys. So, number one, this hair. I forget how much it costs. I'm going to put the link below. Sorry. <laughs> I'm going to put the cost in the um, description box. But, all right. I have in three bundles and a lace closure. Okay? Three bundles and a lace closure. And you can see my lace closure right there. And for my lace closure, I like to leave a little hair out just to have that, like, little natural effect. You see? Yes. I like to have that. I just, I don't know. I just like it like that. Okay? And y'all see I got the Beyonce curls going on right now. Uh. Anyways, <laughs> back to the real world, Kristen. Okay, so, number one question about this hair. Did the hair lose its texture or the curl pattern when I dyed it? Yes. Yes, it did. It did. But, let's start with the texture first. Texture, not so bad. Texture is still soft, still manageable. I still like it. No problems with that. Just when I got the hair, it was extra, extra soft. Like, damn, Gina? Yes, like that. So, um, yeah, it's not a big difference, but I, I could tell because let me just say that I went over this hair about two or three times with the bleach or whatever because bleach is really damaging your hair. You got to understand that when you're doing it so you can't expect all hair to be perfect. It's not going to be perfect. So, at the end of the day, I like the outcome of our results. Um, all right. Now I said the curl pattern. I wasn't too worried about the curl pattern because nine times out of ten, I wasn't going to really wear the hair and it's natural state you know i'm gonna put some curls in and i'm gonna flat iron to keep a bone straight or something that's just the natural state is when i'm going out to the gym or something like that or i just don't feel like doing anything but at 
at the end of the day, most of the times I am going to actually do do my hair, like curl it, flat iron it to keep it bone straight, put some big roller curls up in there. All right, and let's get to the curls. <clears throat> now, for these curls, I had these curls in for about, I say almost an hour and a half right now they did kind of fall a little bit but let me tell you honey let me tell you one a one will really hold the curl in this hair like i can't believe because listen any other any other curling iron i tried it I tried it. It's, it does not work. I tried the curling iron. I tried the flat, try flat, the flat iron curling, trying to curl it with the flat iron. It does not, it does not work for me. Like, it doesn't at first. Initially, I even put rollers in my hair last night, and it came out beautifully this morning. But, you know, after like two hours, them it dropped. That's why I had to do this. And that's why I say the wand curls really, really Hold it. And I am going to show you what wand I have. So Alright, the one. wand curler that I have is by, um, Red by Kiss. Here's the box. It cost me, what, $25? That's not bad. Um, and here is the actual thing. And it comes with, it's, it's really nice. It comes with a glove. And it comes with a little, um, you know, heat pad. So you could put it, instead of putting it on your counter, you could put this on your counter and put the thing on top so it won't burn your counter. So, I really do, I really do like this one. I'm going to have to get um, the other ones. Like, this is a small one. I want a bigger one so I can have bigger curls and stuff. But it's worth $25, believe it. Um, now, the flat iron that I use, I'm currently using my sister's Chi flat iron. Um, now, that, that gets my hair bone straight to the T boo boo, T like for real. Like I'm in love with that flat iron. I have to buy one before she asks for hers back. But um, yes. So I really, really advise you if you want nice curls or whatever, I advise you to get a wand curler, and that's a ceramic wand curler. I, I advise you to get a wand curler because no rollers gonna hold this hair up and no curls, no um, you know. A curling iron is gonna hold no curl in this hair or nothing or whatever. It just it didn't it didn't work for me. It didn't work for me. It might work for you, but it didn't work for me. Um. So yeah, and I did the extra process. I curled it last night and rolled it. So that's a lot of you know a lot of work for it to just fall after two hours. So I'm glad that the wand curls are holding up. I really do like them. Very pretty. So yes. Um. <clears throat> another thing. The biggest question of all, does this hair shed? Now, in my previous videos about this hair, I told you guys that I really wanted to seal my wefts. Did I seal the wefts? No. I just, I did not have time. I did not have time to get to it. So when it was time for me to get my hair done, I was just like, man, forget it. I just didn't have time to. So, I'm going to say, <clears throat> I'm going to say, 70%, no, not even 60% is my fault because I really wanted to seal the webs on this hair to actually see if it was going to do what it's supposed to do and not shade all crazy and stuff. But, hunty, but that 30%, no, that 40%, since I said 60% is on me, that 40%, boo boo, I'm going to have to leave that to um Modern Show Hair. Now, this hair sheds huh t now let let's let's sum this up when i say that the hair sheds okay i'll rub my fingers through it i'll probably get one strand like i did now i got one strand that's not bad but when i brush my hair when i'm detangling my hair it's too much hair for me coming out of this hair it's, it's just too much and i just I just, I, but, um, <laughs> that's why I say 60% is my fault because I should have sealed the wealth like they inform you to do. So, yeah, I'm not going to say this hair sheds as much as my queen's hair. It does not. This hair does pretty good, especially when I have this hair flat iron straight. 
it doesn't give me a problem with shedding. And I don't get... I don't get any shedding off the closure. I just get shedding off, like, the back or whatever. Does this hair get matted up? I'm not... No. No. It doesn't get matted up to me. No. Um... But it, you kind of get some little tangles and stuff, but it depends on, like, you know, what you're doing to your hair that day. Like, if you're putting curls in it, it might you might get a little couple tangles and stuff, but you'll be all right. It's not it's not going to mat up, like, all the way, you know. You're good. As long as you got you a wide tooth comb, honey, and a little paddle brush. So, y'all want to know if this hair was true to length. Yes, it is. I even believe that it's longer. Than what it's supposed to be but here's the hair curl right here and I'll show you in the back stand up straight now imagine when it's bone straight you guys imagine when the hair is bone freaking straight when I say long long real long too long and this is 26 24 and 22 inches yeah um <laughs> so yeah um <clears throat> i'm gonna rate the hair an eight out of ten i really do like the hair it's been two weeks i love the hair i've gotten so many compliments on this hair ah! yes so it is what it is baby who colored your hair oh i colored my hair I color my hair. Me. Yes. Me. I color hair. But, um, <laughs> let me stop. Um, but, yeah, I just wanted to show you guys and give you guys an update because I haven't, I felt like it's been forever. You gotta realize that I'm back in school, so I can't be doing, like, a bunch of videos and everything. I gotta stay focused and focused on work and everything, so... That's what I'm focused on. Focus on this money and focus on them books, and I'm straight. Now, <clears throat> just showing you the hair. And I'm going to say that this hair is worth the money. I don't think I spent, I don't think I spent over $200. Like I said, I will post the link below. But I really don't think I spent over $200. i am trying to think. I don't think so for this hair and that's good for the length of the hair you know and I'm only I plan to keep this hair in for probably another month and then I want well I don't know I'm still thinking I'm still thinking what I want to do I'm stuck between two other hairstyles that I want to try next and you know I'm gonna do a review for those too um, the closure is actually not by the company. I meant to mention that. The closure is not by Model Show Company. I will post the closure link below. I always get my closures from the vendor that I'm going to post below. And they never disappoint me. And the prices are fantastic, wonderful, and free shipping. And um, that's if you... That's if you don't mind waiting like a week for it. And I don't mind waiting like a week for it. If I, if I have my all my stuff planned up or what I want to do, I can do that, okay, for free shipping. I'm not spending no $20 on shipping, you know. <laughs> this hair is called Modern Show Hair. I hope you guys liked it. I hope you guys like my review on this hair. Um, <clears throat> I will say that I deep condition the hair with um, organics products. Um, the Moroccan Argan Oil Conditioner. Um, and what else do I use? I use the, um, some of the Moroccan Argan Oil, the actual oil for this hair. I only put a little bit in my hands and, you know, put it through whatever because you don't need all that oil weighing your hair down, you know. So, that's all. Um, what else do I use on this hair? I think that's it, you guys. Oh, and for my edges, I use the Cure Care Edge Tamer. That's it. So, I will post some pictures of different hairstyles of this hair. So, you can see the different things this hair likes to do. And I will see you guys later. Thank you guys for watching and supporting my channel. Channel. <laughs> channel. <laughs> I don't know what's going on with me. And... Uh, make sure you follow me on Instagram. <clears throat> My Instagram is Kristen.Moore. 
C H R I S T E N dot M O O R E. And my Twitter is at Humbly Talented. Okay. So make sure you guys follow me on there. And if you want to follow me on Snapchat, <laughs> my Snapchat is Chris Tiff Moore. That's C H R I S T I F F M O O R E. That's if you want to follow me on Snapchat because you know I'm always doing a little this and that on Snapchat. Ah, okay. But um, I'll see you guys later.